All right. Meantime, we've been talking a lot recently about drones being flown dangerously close to planes and helicopters. And this is leading to some urgent new concerns from the FAA. And Willie's following that story this morning. Good morning to you. Good morning, Savannah. Good morning, Matt. Reports of these incidents spiking dramatically. In fact, there was just another one yesterday in Fresno, California. And federal officials say it's time for them to stop. According to the newly released FAA report, there have been 650 drone sightings by pilots as of August 9th of this year, compared to a total of 238 sightings in all of 2014. This summer alone, there have been 138 sightings in June and 137 in July. The majority of the drones that are causing the problems are hobbyist drones. The, the people that are flying drones professionally, like law enforcement and this kind of thing, uh, they go by the rules, but the hobbyists, uh, they don't care. The news comes after a close call on Wednesday, where a drone almost hit a medical helicopter carrying a patient in Fresno, California. We almost got hit by a drone, just to let you know. It was probably about 15 feet from the actual aircraft. You could definitely take down the helicopter. Last Sunday, the pilots of four commercial airplanes reported seeing a drone during final approach at Newark Airport. The latest in a series of similar incidents at New York area airports. Drone reported six mile final, 2,200 uh, off to the right side. We land uh, four right, we'll watch for a drone. While firefighters battling this season's historic blazes in the west have had to ground operations several times because of unmanned aircraft. We're trying to get the drone thing uh, situated. If one of these drones was to go into an engine at a critical period, or if one of these drones was to strike the windshield of an airplane, um, they, the results could be catastrophic. Experts say all these sightings are likely because many recreational users just don't know or aren't following rules for the drones, which say you've got to fly below 400 feet and more than five miles from an airport. Obviously, some of these commercial airline pilots are seeing them at two, 3,000, even up to 10,000 right. feet. People either don't know the rules or they're flaunting them. It's shocking how many more incidents there are now, too. Yeah. Willie, thank you.